who is Shawnee Milowebo? If you're a sports fanatic who's into track and field, then you probably already know who Shawnee Milowebo is. But for the others amongst us, not only is she one of the greatest 400 meter sprinters ever to compete in a world class event, but she's also a great role model for anyone out there who has dreams of being a professional athlete someday. We'll walk you through why this Olympic gold medalist is so special. From her epic run at the 2016 Rio Olympics all the way to her upcoming events that are sure to be full of more glory. Please like, subscribe and turn on the notification bell for our future videos. Shawnee Miller Uwebo is a proud Bahamian sprinter who was born and raised in Nassau, Bahamas. Born April 50, 1994 to Maybelline and Sean Miller, Shawnee showed athletic promise from a very early age. When attending high school at St. Augustine's College in Nassau, she persistently thrived, winning multiple medals in both regional and international championships. It was no surprise when she was awarded a scholarship to the University of Georgia. Champion from a young age All her life, Miller Uwebo competed in athletics from a very young age. Back in 2007, she won five gold medals at the Central American and Caribbean Age Group Championships in athletics in the under-14 category. Bronze medals in the relay races followed at the 2009 Carifta Games and the 2009 Pan American Junior Athletic Championships. She claimed the 400-meter titles at the 2010 Central American and Caribbean Junior Championships and the 2010 Carifta Games, as well as four medals for Bahamas, including the 4x100-meter relay and the 4x400-meter relay. Her promising athletic career continued when 16-year-old Miller Weibo became the first Bahamian to be 400 meter champion at the World Junior Championships in Athletics and the youngest woman to ever win the event. She won the gold medal in a time of 52.52 seconds. In the following year, Miller Uwebo won the 2011 World Youth Championships in Athletics again in a time of 51.84 seconds, becoming the first athlete to ever hold both the under-20 and under-18 championship 400-meter titles concurrently. In her last age category competition, before taking on the senior athletes, she won three gold medals, 200 meter, 400 meter, and the 4x100 meters relay at the 2013 Carifta Games and was given the Austin Seeley Award for the best athlete of the competition. On the international stage, when Shawnee Miller Uwebo graduated to the senior level of athletics, she continued her success in the sport. Her first international senior competition was back in the 2012 Summer Olympics in the 200 meters. Though she finished sixth in her semi final heat, this was still massively impressive considering that she was only 18 years old. Two years later, however, at the 2014 Commonwealth Games in Glasgow, Scotland, she won a gold medal in the women's 400 meters. As a result, she became the youngest athlete to win a gold medal in the women's 400 meters in that competition. Additionally, she also became the first Bahamian woman to win any kind of medal at those games. Shawnee Miller Uwebo's ability to perform at her peak in high pressure situations has made her one of the most exciting athletes in track and field. Considered a sprinter with no discernible weakness, Miller Uwebo remained consistent with back to back victories in the 400 meters at the 2015 and 2016 World Championships, cementing her place as one of the best female sprinters today. As of October 2019, Mila Uwebo is ranked as the world's second fastest woman in the 400 meters and has been ranked number one for three years in succession by Track and Field News magazine. She won from each of the last editions of the World Championships 2015, 2017 and 2019, with us becoming an official Olympic champion.
Five years later, at the Tokyo Olympic Stadium in 2021, Shawnee Miller Uibo was in impressious form and had the entire island of Bahamas glued to their television to watch her win gold in a new personal best of 48.36 seconds in the 400 meter, thus winning her second consecutive 400 meter Olympic medal by a comfortable margin, while Mara Lady Paulino of the Dominican Republic claimed silver and Alexon Felix of the United States had to settle for a third place in bronze. Outside of track and field, Shawnee has always been passionate about giving back to the youth of Bahamas. Back in 2017, she formed the Shawnee Miller Cares Foundation, which is focused on supporting and mentoring young people who come from underprivileged backgrounds. For example, her foundation has been a big supporter of children in homes and this Olympic champion has made several presentations of supplies ranging from clothes to PlayStation 4s and a few games to the Ranfurly Homes for Children. The young champion also donated some 25,000 US dollars to the island's communities of Grand Bahama and Abaco, which were devastated by the passing of Hurricane Dorian back in 2019, which left 84 people dead and 245 still listed as missing. Shawnee Miller Uibo is married to Michael Uibo, a former track and field athlete from Estonia. The pair met when they both attended school in Georgia and have been together ever since. By the way, if you find the information in this video useful, we would greatly appreciate it if you would give this video a like. Go ahead, just click the like button just below. Thank you. Is this the end of Shawnee Miller Uibo? In a recent statement, the reigning Olympic 400-meter champion, Shawnee Miller Uibo, has revealed that she expects to step away from the event in the next Olympic Games. Miller Uibo has the seventh fastest time in the 400 meters of all time and the third fastest in the last 25 years. To be honest, I don't think I'll be going back to the 400 meters that year, 2024. Miller Uibo said, ahead of the Diamond League's meet in Rome, I'm planning on wrapping it up. I've accomplished so much in the event. For me, it's just about getting to the world title now. Despite dominating at the Olympics, the athlete has never won the world championship title, with her best results coming in 2015 and 2019, when she was second behind Alex and Felix and Salwar Idnasa, respectively. In the future, she says she plans on focusing on the 200 meter instead. So maybe we'll continue to see Shawnee, just in a different event. Nevertheless, we'll see Miller Uibo in several events before the Olympics, and we already have. In just March of this year, she competed in the World Indoor Championships in Belgrade, Serbia, where she won the 400 meters. She's also expected to get her career's gold at this year's World Championship in Oregon in July when she competes in the 400 meters against world-class athletes such as Fem Cable, Jamaican Stacian Williams, and Sharaki Young, and gold medalist from last year's World Championship, Salwad Eid Nasa. We can also expect to see her compete at the Commonwealth Games this year in Birmingham. These two events are expected to be major track and field clashes as Miller Uibo looks to cement her place as the undisputed 400 meter champion of a generation. In conclusion, as you can see, Shawnee Miller Uibo is an incredible athlete, one who has garnered much success in her career with a long line of wins all while committed to giving back to her home island of the Bahamas and serving underprivileged youth so they too can achieve their dreams. And she has done all of this at such a young age. That means there's still plenty of time for her to continue breaking records, winning medals and becoming a beacon for her country and the people of the Bahamas. What do you think of Shawnee Miller Uibo's accomplishments? Please let us know in the comment section below. Also, tell us what or who else with Caribbean roots you would like to see us cover. Please like, subscribe and share our channel with others and turn on the notification bell for our next video as we explore the Caribbean and its people together. Thanks again. Stay jiry.